Good morning, friends. Happy Sunday. My name is Miss Heather, and I'm so excited that you are here to worship with us this morning. It is going to be a great day. Pastor Corey this morning is going to be talking to us about blessings. And if you know me, you know that this is my favorite word because I know that you are a blessing. And I think it's one of my most important jobs to make sure that you hear that and you know it because God made you and God loves you and he created you to do something wonderful and amazing in this world that nobody else can do. There's nothing you can do to earn his love. It just is. You are a precious child of God and so very loved. And as a precious child of God, you also have this incredible responsibility because you have been blessed so that you can be a blessing to others. I have been so encouraged by the ways that I've seen you blessing your communities in this time of quarantine. I've seen you guys writing cards and drawing pictures to send to our church family. I've seen you guys writing encouraging notes and chalk art on your driveway. I've seen you donating books and uh, running marathons and doing amazing things to help people know God's love. Where has your family seen blessings in the last couple weeks? Maybe if you're watching on Facebook, you could put it in the comments so all of us could see how God's love is moving and changing our world even when we can't be together. This week, I wanna challenge you to think about how you could be a blessing to someone else. It's a little tricky when we have to stay in our homes, isn't it? But I bet you can come up with a super creative way to help other people see God's love. Maybe it's writing a card or drawing a picture, or maybe it's something totally different. Whatever it is, I hope that you use the blessings that God has given you to bless someone else this week. Will you guys pray with me? You can repeat after me. Dear God, thank you for creating us to be a blessing. Thank you, God, for loving us so much. Help us to share that love everywhere we go. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Friends, what sermon about blessings would be complete without a blessing itself? So if you um, would like a blessing, maybe on your hand or maybe on your forehead, go ahead and move it really close to the screen so that I can bless you. Are you ready? Friends, you are a blessing and so very loved. I hope that you have an amazing week.